That's right, ghouls and goblins. <laughs> what I had lined up next, you never could have guessed. For the first time ever on this channel, it's the Mutant Football League. I have never played this game before. I have never watched anyone play this game before. I'm aware of this game. And I just had the thought in my head this morning, I don't know where it came from or why, to look at this game with it being Super Bowl Sunday. And sure enough, it was on sale today for $3. And I said $3 for an amusing maybe 30 minute bit odd stream. I mean, what more could $3 buy? So <laughs> tonight, we're tuning in for the first ever Watt FL Mayhem Bowl. It's Mayhem Bowl time. We got the Carcass City Creeps taking on the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Oh boy, what a game it's going to be. Uh, let's see. Let's do... I, I looked in the settings on this a little bit. Just to know what I was getting into. Alright, did those save? Let's do three minute quarters. Here we go, folks. Is it going to pay off? Or is it going to be a total dud? There's only one way to find out. Welcome to one of the cornerstone cities for the NFL, Grim Bay, Wisconsin, home of the Attackers. Also home of the first semi-successful head transplant, Grim. Yeah, oh whatever God. happened to that poor guy? Well, he did all right for himself. He's the state mascot for head cheese. It's the Mayhem Bowl, and today's matchup features the two best teams in the league. So true. The oh. Carcass City Creeps take on the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Hi everyone, Grim Blitzer on deck for tonight's presentation of the Mayhem Bowl. We are going down to the sidelines now Slam to listen the pregame speech. Yeah. Looks like this could go either way. Anybody got a crowbar? Two Super Nancy Kerrigan jokes. Oh my god. Deflate gate. Patrick, my homies. Kickoff oh, I, I'm so I'm so overstimulated right now. Just moments away. I'm so overwhelmed right now. Commentator Brickhead Mulligan and the mini Pez dispenser on his shoulder, Bricks Jr. Grim, I can't wait for the Mayhem Bowl start. I got a lot of money riding on it. Pez dispenser, huh? Better than having that crap dispenser pile you got for a while. If I had my camera on, you could see how perplexed I am right now. Uh, here we go. I left the commentary on because I don't... Pissed and caffeinated. Because I don't know anything about football. Oh my god! Uh, so I don't feel like I could adequately do the play-by-play -play for this, so... They'll help us out a bit? As you can see, the teams are staffed with... Players of skeletons, werewolves, and xenomorphs? Yeah, I bet you didn't think you'd be coming back to see this. <laughs> Pissed the McCaffinated running down the field. First down. Uh, but the, my understanding is the players can die in this game. I don't think we've seen a death yet. Just keep your eyes peeled. And your fingers crossed. I used to play Mutant League games all the time on Sega and SNES. Oh, no shit. I know this series has been around for quite some time. I've never played any of them before. Straight to the Xenomorph. Oh, right in the drink. Knocked loose. Love that band. Rito Slamuel? He's injured. I thought he was... I thought he was out of commission, but he's simply on ice, I suppose. Hi-Fi wants to see death. Oh, and there's robots, I think. Of course, Taylor Swift and Joe Biden walk, watching anxiously from the uh, bleachers here. Oh, my God. 
Blind Willie Toker is a 10 yard penalty on the San Francisco Spencico for okay. It's a lot of dialogue there. <laughs> so much happening right now. They're attacking the referee. I'm Don Dirty Money Dingleberry, and I'm the new official. I plan on surviving every attempt to kill me. I'm like the happiest pirates in that sense. This game's like a lot raunchier than I thought it was going to be for some reason. Third down, and the offense needs a miracle. I guess you can just attack the referee. I've, I've not played this game at all. Like, this is how I'm experiencing it for the first time. Uh, you can see the Xenomorph and Robot are in council here. You can die, attack the referee, fall through the ice. Hiko Zowie show. Uh, from the from the stars to the to the rink. That might have been a death. I saw a lot of blood on that ice. The necromorphs, necromongers, maybe. Non-distinct penis aliens. We got a fumble. Dead coroner's got the ball. He's going back. He's got to pull it off. First touchdown for the Fran Sicko 40 Nightmares. But Zach Amon is a tradition passed down from Shafas on Black Friday. Oh, Isaiah Pasht is dead. Rip to the go. And here comes the extra point attack. Is it offensive that I think all skeletons talk like that, by the way? Is it a harmful stereotype? And, goes right through. and that's another one up for the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. Leo Chul and Grit Stones on the bench, and they're not coming back out tonight, folks. How many people to a team in this game? Like, how many people die before it becomes a problem? Kiko Zowie Show. He's doing the old armadillo. No, the ice. With the neon green blood. My spin kick. Oh. I think his pelvis has just been pulverized. The game's up for grabs. Don't worry, folks. We're only at quarter two. This should go by pretty quick. I, I encouraged this to go by pretty quick. I think, in theory, it could go quite longer than this, but there's no need for that. So these games cool? Like, should I play this game? Like, I'm not saying I would stream more of it. Should I, like, play some of this game, though, maybe? Instead of just letting it be a, a $3 stream gag? Tarek McKillen. And picks up media deuce at most. Uh, speaking of deuces, I got a, uh, <clears throat> hey, you got a dollar for the bathroom attendant? I guess that skeleton's talking time. like how I've been <laughs> voicing each skeleton. So, and Bony Frowns and sending it across the ice. When his brain is unscrambled, <laughs> he'll be thinking about bad hit. Yeah, You've been watching too many after school specials. Dreams don't come true on my field. <laughs> It's more water. His voices are killing me. And it's first and ten. <clears throat> I'm like not sick anymore, but I still have a lingering cough. Holy shit, he's got the shock wave. And he's touchdown! I can't quite call this the same I, as I do wrestling. A penalty. Penalty on the wolf. Stupid and he penalty on the carcass and he creeps for insisting that Rush is better than Led Zeppelin. That's 10 yards. <laughs> First and goal. Yeah, it's got werewolves as well. I, I think I saw there was like a demon d DLC as well. Oh, everybody's going in the drink tonight. Bad boys, bad boys. Now this is what we're going to do. 10-yard penalty, carcass city creeps. Don Dirty Dingleberry dishing them out. Everybody went in the drink on that one, and crust and bleed ain't coming back. Rito Slamuel, even. You hate to see that. Has some NFL Blitz DNA in it. Yeah, I remember NFL Blitz. Oh, is that a power bomb? I can call that when I see it. I'm Philip May Pockets. Oh, it's on the ref. I've been reincarnated seven times. I was making Detroit weak before any of your ancestors were a single cell. So don't cross me. 
I know a good Batista bomb when I see it. And Dave is laughing from the set of Doom 2. Unquestionably. Here comes Piston the Caffeinated. God, he's lightning quick. Oh, what a brutal hit. I, oh, my God. Oh, my God. The offense calls a timeout. This is why you save your timeouts. You can use them the in the 40 Nightmares. Now I get it. Sure Call them for a timeout so they can re-strategize here. They are trying to murder his ass. Oh, hi, Fly Live. Thank you for the visits again, sir. With the D-E-A-T-H. She loves... He loves to see that um, mortality displayed here on the ice tonight. I wonder, could you, like, in theory, murder your, the entire team? Like, are there going to eventually be less people than there should be on the field? Is that already happening? I don't know. I don't know anything about football. Jordan Mayhem, expert pass. But he's... Oh! I don't know. It's quite a power bomb. But it was as close as it needed to be to get the job done. You know, too, by the way, speaking of wrestling, as I always am, if the servers didn't get taken down on 2K22, I, I would have totally done some dumb shit in that game tonight instead of this. And the drink, Brian Cook, he picks it up at the fumble. He's going. Oh, what? What are you doing, Brian? Pick up the speed. He goes right in the drink. Right in the drink. This is bullshit. This is garbage. Where the fuck you going, Brian? What the hell you think of Brian? He had it. Why'd he slow down? He got tired, I guess. He's getting gassed. Sack attack. Say fuck. You can say fuck in this. This game's way raunchier than I thought it was. Patrick, my homie's dead. That's a reference I even get. He played in the Super Bowl tonight. And it's first and ten. <clears throat> Oh, he must have been on that team for a long time. This game came out in 2018. Holy sh- <laughs> Unbelievable. The guy turned on the knots, and here we go. It's another miss fight. Tarek McKillen is dead. <laughs> Rip Tarek. The 2K22 servers are on. I would have definitely done, like, Travis Kelsey versus... Because you know there'd be like super accurate crater wrestlers. And you could have like Taylor Swift at ringside. Maybe a mixed tag match? I don't know who would be the 49ers uh, famous woman. I don't know if anybody comes to mind for that role. <laughs> anyway! Chomperius Gord, Jimmy! But a huge interception. I'm just lucky I have the hands of a receiver. Only eight grand on Eastleigh. I like that there's just like a xenomorph in this game. And it's first and ten. When they were thinking of like the different archetypes to put in this, they're like, uh, orcs? Werewolves? Robots? And uh, xenomorphs. The four genders. If that's definitely the skeleton voice I've been doing. You just basically do like Skeletor or Meow. We're at halftime. San Francisco Nightmare is up for the only points on the board this evening. Who we got in the halftime show? Uh... Oh, I guess that's that. I was hoping they bothered to program a halftime show. In. It's a close one out there. This is your chance to make a play that might make you a legend. You know what legends get. Some of your uniforms are only a little dirty. In a game this close, I want to see blood, mud, tears, big weeping wounds come in the works. Here comes the kickoff. Let's see if the defense can hold them. Just catch it, run it back into We're already halfway through this game, and the Carcass City creeps have failed to get on the board. But the Geekos oh, Howie Show rolling. Snapping and cracking. Now he's, and he's just absolutely gushing green out across the ice. Tonight. And it's first and ten. Oh. 
You know, I suppose real... Oh my god. <laughs> that QB is not some sacred player on the field. Call me sacrilegious for saying that if you must. Uh, I was going to say, real football, I guess, has fatalities in it, too. They're just not quite as blatant. They're long and painful and tragic. The uh, CTE. But here in this game, we play Murder Bowl. We got CBT. Because we're stomping on your cojones right now, Commodore. Omen Burps has been assassinated. If Jenter has entered the, tr the field, troll doll biker. And it's first and ten. Yes, how could I forget? I'm so sorry. I'm doing my best. I'm doing my best, I assure you. And the defense gives up five yards there. Unbelievable. Oh, Brian! <laughs> Got pulped! So sorry, Brian. Second down and five. Chris Orlando Boone? Is there a football player whose last name is Orlando Boone? I, I'm gathering that a lot of their names are references to real people. But maybe not all of them. Oh, I love, I love the brief fuck fest after they blow the whistle while they just all start punching each other. Reed Gumphrey. Like, I'm curious, does it just keep, like, generating new players? When Owens die? That's a 15-yard unnecessary manslaughter penalty on the San Francisco 40 Nightmares. I know you guys want to win, but don't you think going after the quarterback is a bit low down? Rest in peace, Chris Orlando Boone. I just noticed you, and now we'll never see you again. Is that a fart? So much happening in this game. Space Felon! My favorite quarterback! I've got his rookie card in my collection. Second down and ten. Uh, that's a that's an amazing name. Here we go. Can he? Oh, no. <laughs> Hit him with that flying arm drag and the elbow drop. Get the windshield wipers out. We got Green Pool up front. Space Felon's got what it takes. He's, he's running it. <laughs> he didn't prepare for. Oh my God! Space Felon's dead. Oh no, Space Felon. I thought he was going to be the one. And be second and but now he's just the one above. I heard there was a lot of like weird Jesus commercials for uh, Super Bowl today. Advertising Jesus? Anybody know anything about that? First down. Oh. First down and five. I saw there was a trailer for the new Deadpool movie, a trailer for the new Twister movie, and a lot of commercials about Jesus. That's the end of three, and it's anyone's Third game. quarter's out. Again, Maybe San Francisco Nightmares. Only ones to get on the board tonight so far. First down and five. We know Kansas City had what it took in the Super Bowl, but can Carcass City pull it out with the mayhem ball? Breaking oh, glass. Incomplete. He threw it when no one could catch it. Something like that. Hombre and Commodore on the stretchers being sent home. To enjoy what little time they've got left. Second down and five. Only a few minutes left on the clock here. A new Jesus movie coming. I don't think so. <laughs> I don't think it was. I actually, well, yes, there is. I think there's two Jesus movies coming out because I saw trailers for both of them at the movie theater yesterday, which is pretty wild because I was uh, not seeing a Jesus movie. <laughs> But I think it was just for, like, the general concept for Jesus. I think we're just... I think it was just commercials for the good word, right? Touchdown! Who was that? The Car Carcass City's up on the board. Oh, man, what if this goes to overtime? Just like the Super Bowl. Carcass City creeps penalized. Ten yards of ghost at me after I thought we were hitting it off. Real mature. Minus broken is injured. Very ironic, considering his last name. Oh, but they really did get a penalty. Okay. Well, everybody could just decide to kill the fucking referee. And, like, that doesn't warrant a penalty. They really did lose their touchdown on that. 
Ravage Belch. Oh, my God. Defense pretty hard on that one. What a tragedy. He just, just narrowly escaped the uh, ice hole there, but still got the double decker fuck fest on the ice. Going to kick. They got it, but it's not going to get them where they need to be. Take the dub with so little time left on the clock. Though anything could happen in this game, evidently. Uh, you could just kill the ref. You could kill your opponents. And somehow this will be the most I've understood football in my entire 31-year-old life. I see the bit rate's going to absolute hell. Are we good? It's like the stream cut out for 10 seconds. Whoa, it's a lightning storm on the field and then the fumble! Marcos Carcassus has got the ball, and he's going to do what it takes to get Carcass City ahead. Unbelievable. Look at him. A glistening werewolf. You're a grease lightning. A little bloody light. Just as fast. Carcass City is up ahead, folks. Do you believe in miracles? Carcass City looks to finish the story with this kick! 10 to 7 with only a minute 35 left in the fourth quarter. Slain Meanjaw going back to the locker room. Uh, thanks for playing. What Jesus movies are they? I think it's, I think it's Jesus 2 Electric Boogaloo. And it's like nowadays, like big studios, they just green light sequels before the first sequels even made, like Avatar and Marvel and stuff. So I think it's just, the, I think the third one is uh, Jesus 3, the re Resurrection, Revelation, Origins. Piston the caffeinated tap, stop! Unbelievably, he's a juggernaut, they keep trying! They cannot get him to stop, but they finally do. First down. Holy shit, I thought he was going to go the whole way. Very. Look, San Francisco 40 Nightmares, you friended me a while back, and I'm sick of your political posts on Facebook. They follow on with the dislike button. 10 yard penalty. San Francisco. Oh, no. <laughs> is this, this has happened after every penalty? Bill the Shill Hill. I don't want to be here any more than you do, fellas, but you killed the ref before me, so now I, Bill the Shill Hill, have to be here and give the San Francisco Nightmares 15 yards. First down and There's not much field left for them to fall back on. And they've got a long way to go if they're going to pull ahead here in the first ever Mayhem Bowl. Chris Stones, thanks for playing. We'll miss you. And Greedo Slamuel, uh, he'll be back next year, no doubt, no doubt, no doubt. The onside kick is the desperation play, but it's their only chance at this point to steal possession. The desperation play, oh, and I don't think it's going how they had envisioned, but the, but the trash man, the trash man crimps it through the clip. Never mind. Went just about as well as the trash man's Watt CW debut in the Real Rumble uh, last month. And a matter of fact, put him on ice. I know he's, he just was, but you know what I mean. The offense wants to speed things up, so it signals up. We got to speed things up. The bit rate can't stand much more of this. We want to see this till its logical conclusion, please, brother. Time out. 40 Nightmares calling for that timeout. Oh, nope. oh, wait, are these a, is this Carcass City? I, I lost. I lost it. <laughs> Who's on offense now? They're both red. This is... I think maybe this is Carcass City. And the punter takes a break from knitting on the sidelines to come in and punt. His knitting is in Pondgren. That cross-stitching, unbelievable. Are they kicking it at Carcass City? I don't know. And he just lets that one go. He says, no thank you. And the it's Carcass down. White. I lost track. I'm so... I don't understand football. And it's first and ten. 
All right, I think this is Carcass. Here. Balls in their position. They've oh shit! Free gun free. Offense recovers. But I don't think it could possibly matter. Oh my god, hide Deadwood's hell air. He made it so far into this, only to die with seconds left on the clock. That's tragic. All Garka City has to do is run out the clock, and that trophy is theirs in the first ever. What FL Mayhem Bowl generic wins! Running out of field! The clock's out! It's over! Wow! to the final second. We crown a new Mayhem Bowl champion today. Or what remains of them? Yeah, they've got the entire offseason to regrow their limbs. Let's listen in on the Mayhem Bowl MVP. I hope they play my highlights in slow mode this time. That's the only way to show all of my many good sides. Just edit out all the chunks of brain Once and again, bones the of the bruises I crush. our viewing audience and the Mutant Football League for allowing us to telecast this sports presentation of the Mayhem Bowl. Until next season, this is Grim Blitzrow with Brickhead Mulligan and Bricks Jr. signing off. And that's a wrap. All right, that's another season, boys. Good job. Hey, Bricks, the cheerleaders in, huh? Hey, Junior, start rolling. On it, boss. I love you guys. We got the best gig in the world. Hey, stow it, dipshit. Start filling the hot tub. Hey, where's the champagne? Today's final game stats are wow. brought to you by the Micro Hard Corporation. Great get stuff. Right every up. That's all one dude. Yeah, I think you're right. He's almost as good of a voice actor as me. Wow. Art reflects reality as the, uh, whatever they were called, the creeps. <laughs> the creeps take it home to, uh, Slayler Swift and Ghost Raiden. <laughs> So proud as are all of us here at home who just love the game and the opportunity to watch it. A bit that was totally worth the three dollars behind it. Who knows? Perhaps the birth of a new annual tradition. <laughs> we'll see. We'll see if I care to reinstall the game next February. I don't know, I might play this. Wouldn't this be amazing if this is how I like came to understand how football works is by playing this? I think they got yeah, they have like a single player like Franchise mode, yeah. Maybe, maybe I will. I don't know. It'll be fun. Not saying I'd stream it. I think I had enough on my plate. Anyway, <laughs> anyway, thanks for sticking around for this dumb bit. Uh, this is amusing enough. Um, that's gonna be it for tonight. I learned about football and hockey from Mutant League. Okay. <laughs> you know, I suspect that there's a storied history of this game teaching weirdos like us how sports work by adding like goblins and gore and to be fair if the nfl had goblins and gore i probably would have bothered to watch more of it growing up same with the xfl it's supposed to be extreme but where are the goblins huh blood bowl is a thing it's warhammer football oh really i had no idea I love monster football. <laughs> oh, high five. Thank you for the bits once again. Bedtime for you as it is for me. Thanks for watching, my friend. Again, thank you for being uh, Mr. 200 over here. We've been waiting for that that big follow, so thank you for helping us cross the threshold. And thank you for tuning in for all the bits. And the MVP, sir, I'll definitely uh, I'll have to catch you next time you go live. I'll be looking out for you. Thanks for tuning in. Thanks to anybody who tuned in. I know this was I, I, either... Either a less than ideal night or a great night to go live. Uh, you know, everybody's busy watching the Super Bowl. Uh, yeah, we'll call this counter programming, right? That's a thing. Uh, thanks to everybody who tuned in. It's so fun. Good little stream to end the weekend. Appreciate y'all. I am going to go to bed as well. Um, I should be back on Tuesday night with Mr. Matt Thomas. We'll be playing more. That's right. Avatar Frontiers of Pandora, your favorite game to watch. I we have I think two more streams of that until we'll be done. 
I, I can't tell. There seems to, there's a lot of variety in like how long the missions are in that game. So when, like when I look at the list of missions remaining, it seems like we have two. But maybe not. It could be one. I, don't, I guess we'll just see how it goes on Tuesday. If not, we got two more of those. And now that I've finished Valhalla, and I can put it on the finished list, um, I'll be starting Alan Wake 2. So I'm thinking Avatar on Tuesday and Alan Wake 2 on Thursday, probably. We'll see. But thanks for tuning in. Appreciate you. Love you. Um, hope you enjoy the rest of your evening. Sweet dreams. And um, have a great week. And I'll see you all on Tuesday. Thanks for watching. Play ball. Good night.